okay today we'll start with the material design how you are going to deal with the material design Android Studio has given you many things related to material design everything that you need Android Studio has provided like see this thing so this is something a simple template basic template I have created so this black color is called as what you can say snack bar this circle is called as what you can say fab floating action button and this icon right this is called as actions or options menu over here right this is called as action bar and option menus settings and other things we'll see how to deal with this thing but before that what is material design so this is a native website given to us by the Google right this is a native website of the material design see what they are saying about the material design we challenged ourselves to create the visual language for our user that synthesizes the classic principles of good design with the innovation and possibly the technology and science this is the material design they have defined the material design in very first thing right this specification is a living document that will be updated as we continue to develop the tenants and the specifics of the material design right this is not fixed remember that this would be getting changing so if you can what you can say if you can go on reading this document you will come to know right design goals to create the visual language that synthesizes the classic principles of good design right that is material design why they created the material design right S develop a single underlying system that allows for a unified experience across platforms and the device sizes right material design is not only for the device it is for the web as well okay material is a metaphor bold graphic intentional right motion provide meaning animations they are speaking something about animations right see material design is three dimensional environment containing the light material and the shadows cast shadows material design is three dimensional environment containing the light material and the shadows if you can see this thing can you see I, I hope you can see this little bit shadow below this button right little bit shadow below this fab see all material objects have X Y Z dimensions all material objects have a single Z axis position you'll come to know over this thing when you see this fab over here right see the colors they have used right can you see the shadow below elevation right shadows are created by the elevation difference between the material overlapping material this white one is the material with the thickness 1 dp right with the thickness 1 dp so shadows is like this created by the elevation difference between the overlapping material see it is a guideline it is absolutely not possible to learn this thing in one tutorial right we are going to use and much of the things right much of the things are already implemented can you see this fab this is called as floating action button you don't need to create it Google has given you or one library has given you this fab over here right there is one class called as floating action button and this is nothing but this this is something 3d world your your object is resident of z axis this light and shadow right shadow cast by the key light shadow cast by the ambient light right and shadow by mixed it is nothing but the mix cast and the ambient right so like this many things are there material properties so this is a document this is related to the document right how you are going to do what you can say material characteristics solid occupies the unique points in the space see material has a certain immutable characteristics and inherent behaviors understanding these qualities of the material will help you now look at this website how does it looks very precise and the clean this distance is fixed right whatever this distance is fixed this distance is also fixed right this distance 
is also fixed sorry what happened this distance is also fixed this distance is fixed this is also fixed this is also fixed the icon they have used that is also fixed right means all these things are coming can you see one shadow over here right I mean to say this shadow if you can check the shadow below this material typically right and here are the characteristics you can see this or you can read on your own afterwards the physical properties like this see they are saying the height and width of the material can vary material is always one dp of thick they are talking about this material this 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 that is always one dp right dp is the unit of the android right dp is nothing but the density independent pixels is nothing but the dp right if you want to get in detail you can get my another video on the measurement units view measurement units so they have given everything over here right do's and don'ts you will find over here do's and don'ts related to animation or moving effects right movement of the material here you will find elevation and the shadows how that will objects in the material design process are process similar qualities to objects in the physical world like this see elevation measured from the front of one surface to the front of the another see this is called as elevation right front of one this is a front view right this is nothing but the front view of the two material so this is something fab and this is underlying material so this would be the 2 dp this distance resting elevation dynamic elevation offset so we don't have that much time to read all these things right you can go on reading and see how that works see like this okay fine i want to show you something matrix and the key lines if you see this thing layout under the layout you will find matrix and the key lines how your android app would be see this would be the simple design and this is nothing but your one fab this is nothing but one content if you can check the whatsapp ui right if you can check the whatsapp ui or uh, if you want to get profile picture of someone right you can get the full screen profile picture as well as that scrolling effect that is also kind of material right see all these things can you see this thing this distance this distance this distance they have given 16 dp would be the distance 17 d 72 dp would be this distance this would be the again 16 dp all these things are fixed right all these things are fixed and you can work on these things right with the help of predefined libraries in the android there are many predefined libraries some of them are provided by the google or some of them are the third party right but you can feel free to use them don't worry okay like this see matrix and key lines how it would be looking on the web and how it would be looking on the android right many things are there they have covered many things over here so it will look like this thing so this is nothing but the color code of this how this will look how this will look like this navigation drawer we'll see all these things in the lecture right fine so this is nothing but a little bit about material design guidelines see structure i am going to come back to this thing once we are going to learn the navigation drawer and the toolbars right till then i am freezing it over here and we'll meet in the next tutorial where i am going to explain how to create many things related to material design okay keep watching and if you like our videos kindly subscribe us